Based on Ministry of Health Malaysia statistic, 65% of newborn babies face jaundice, and Malaysia babies have been known to have higher level of significant jaundice. So, as a medical electronics engineering student, the problem of jaundice quantification appears as a challenge to be solved. We will introduce to you a non-invasive method of jaundice quantification using simulating model-based design. For that reason, we do collaboration with Dr. Azizan Aziz, a pediatric specialist at Hospital Sultanah Nora Ismail Batu Pahat. Jaundice is a discoloration of skin and sclera caused by deposition of bilirubin. The, uh, the problem can arise when the level of bilirubin exceeding the safe level. So for this matter, the jaundice need to be monitored uh, regularly. So the most commonest method for monitoring jaundice is by doing blood sampling. However, this procedure need acquire a skill and uh, for pricking the child. So sometimes it can cause discomfort or pain during this procedure. Blood sampling is the gold standard in measuring the serum delivery level. If there is another method that comparable and measurable in determining the jaundice level, uh, i.e. the bilirubin level in the body, uh, it will be better as this can relieve uh, discomfort and pain to patients. theory and electronic engineering, we build a system which is able to quantify jaundice non-invasively. This method will not give harmful effect to baby and will help medical personnel quantify the jaundice in more efficient and easy way. At the beginning of detection system, the light from LED was emitted to mock skin. Then, the photodiode captured the reflected light from the skin. The photodiode convert light energy to electrical signal. The electrical signal was then processed in Arduino Uno which have been programmed using Simulink software. Now, the quantification of jaundice become more easy and infant-friendly.